My name is Seti Demirkova and I would like to thank you so much for joining us today. As you may read in the interview, I came from Bulgaria, a former communist country. Until age 16, I had no idea that there was a God, that He loved me, that He believed in me. It was at that time that communism fell in Bulgaria and through missionaries from Germany I heard the Gospel for the first time. I began to read the Bible and by the time I was 18 years of age, I knew that the only thing that I wanted to do for the rest of my life is travel, preach the gospel, help people from my country and also from other nations. Through a series of miracles, I came to the States at age 19, supernaturally learning the language in a couple of months and starting school at Victory Bible Institute in Tulsa, Oklahoma. I arrived to this country by myself with $100 and I sometimes joke that I only knew about a hundred words of English. And here I am, 19 years later. My journey in America was a journey of faith and still is. We have been able to establish a nonprofit organization, Changing a Generation, that serves about a thousand children from three different nations, Bulgaria, Ghana, and Uganda. Our entire purpose is to help kids who are at risk of being trafficked, or without education or come from extremely poor families or orphanages to be able to receive education, to receive hope, to know that they are loved and they don't have to live a life on the street. We have been able to see a lot of kids whose parents have sometimes ready to sell them to a trafficker, rescued and put into school especially the kids that we serve in Africa and as well as the Roma children in Bulgaria. This is my hope, it is my urgency as well every single day to wake up, to know that because we have a noble cause, we have a noble purpose, that we can show up without asking for permission or invitation and do good in places that they do not even know how to ask for help. So I just want to encourage you today, don't stop, keep on pressing through because there are other people waiting on the other side of your obedience. There may be children, there may be adults, there may be young people that need to hear your story of how you overcame, of how you began a business, of how you started a nonprofit, of how you persevered through your trials and circumstances. No matter what the odds look like, and no matter who is for you or against you. Please remember this. When you have God, you do have everything that you need and you can overcome everything that you need to overcome in your life because He is greater than the impossibilities that you face. Continue to do good. Continue to follow your heart. Continue to believe in a cause bigger than yourself and you will see your dreams come true. Thank you.